Okay, I don't have much memory on my phone, so I'm gonna make this quick. This is my motor. I converted to a vertical, sh a horizontal shaft from vertical. It used to lie down the other way. I mean, this was the bottom. It was an edger, tiller, engine. Um, what I've done, I'll go over quick here. Um, I used a bolt right here. If you can see where I'm kind of pointing in there. And I just bolted that in to here with a nut on the back side to hold the gas tank on, the car on. I actually, if you can see in there, I put some um, washers, gaskets, full rings in there. And then I ran a wire in there, which I don't know how long it's going to last. But it was temporary until I could put a band or something around it. I ran a wire around to the gas, to the muffler. And I wrapped it around it. On the muffler, and that, that holds carburetor on. Um, and then I did the in, internal modifications, the little oil flinger, and we'll start her up. Let me put you down for a second. in her right now so I'm gonna let it stall out and the wife's not hiding. But it does run. I probably have to set something on the carb so it, it idles better. See there's nothing on it. But that's what it is and that's it, you know? It is what you get. That's her. Briggs Briggs and Stratton. 3.5 horse. Classic. Converted. Oil slinger and everything. If you want to see more pictures or have any questions on how it's done, how it works, ask away.